We're now down to the final five highlights in our Bracket Buster Plays of the Week. We've had you vote for the best plays so far from 2016, which included basketball plays at both the high school and college levels, as well as hockey. The winner from each of our three semifinal rounds were automatic to get here, and now we have two wild cards to round out the final five WPTZ Top Plays of the Week. Tipping off our final top plays is Middlebury's Sarah Kaufman beating the buzzer of the half-court shot. This is one of the best of 2016 to start the year. Stands alone, but will it be enough to get through the week. Our next play, let's lace them up with the skates. Plattsburgh's Dylan Fox scores off the lethal toe drag to go around the Oswego defenseman. Fox won his bracket buster in an overwhelming fashion a few weeks back. Can he repeat the performance? Back to the hardwood, we've got Mariah's Adam Jaquish and Taylor Slarity teaming up. The one-handed dunk, just like they did in football, for touchdowns. Following that, we have Burlington's Kevin Garrison forcing the turnover against Rice Memorial, where he would throw down a dunk on the other end. He's hoping to turn that into a bracket buster winner after finishing third in his previous round. Rounding out our top plays is another example of defense. Turning into offense, Lake Placid's Chris Williams, player of the year in Section 7, blocks the shot, then out hustles two defenders to put the puck on the net. We'll have the results coming up for you on Thursday. Ken Drake, News Channel 5.